السلام عليكم ورحمة الله الوقت معايا عربية بولكس فاجن جولف 7 مغيرة التويل اللي هو تحت هنا كده ده و بكابل الفاز اخش اقودها اونلاين بالاوديس برضه هي هنا مدية اهو Component Theft Protection Infotainment Availability is currently limited Please switch on ignition Hello everybody now I'm having this car which is Volkswagen Golf 7 and uh, the gateway module that's fitted there has been replaced and as you see here I have safe component protection So using pass cable and the software, we'll open the software. I will code it online. You see the blinking on the dashboard and safe component protection. And here also I have component protections active. So I will scan the car with or the service software then I will go online to program it and code it okay I will wait for that because this will take some time and come back again so now I'm having save and the program opened and I will go for start diagnosis Now the software is analyzing pin. Maybe this conflict because the gateway module itself has been replaced. I need also to double check if that VIN number is correct for this car or this VIN came from the gateway they used one without job Here you have to wait for this. Read control units.
Now it began to read the fault codes from the control units. Look for the blinking on the dashboard. This software is very slow, but we have to wait for it. Click on vehicle network. Okay, we should have something, uh, something here related to component protection to follow. Yes, that. I'm sorry. Yes, should be that one. Electronic central electric component protection active. Go lower. Also, component protection on the cluster and component protection on the gateway. Okay, I think we should follow that that one with the address nineteen and this one is for information electronics here 005F so we need to go to that that one and perform test <clears throat> The component protection basic programming is performed in the following. Please hold the vehicle key continuously in front of the reader coil. This one, if you have a proximity key, but on this car, it is already in front of the reader coil. So, done, continue. We should wait for the data collection.
okay now I will wait for the user and password and come back again now I put the user and password and here the component data bus is activated the component instrument cluster is activated you see here also this for that one you see now the cluster it is steady without blinking and here I have the infotainment okay without component protection the component protection basic programming was carried out successfully the four components have been activated component data bus OBD interface component electronic central electric airbag instrument cluster information electronics one information electronics one okay so go to done And now I need to clear fault codes, but this one seems to be okay, and also the cluster without the blinking. Now I will clear fault codes and scan the car again to see what we are having next. Now and after finishing the component protection, I cleared fault memory and I have these errors here after scanning the car again. I think this fault code is related to, look for that one. I think these fault codes are related to the gateway itself. Okay, if you go to fault memory, transmission, you see, engine, all of them are not communicating with the steering column here, gateway, headlamp, loose communication, screws, control, uh, control unit in the steering wheel, Maybe we need to adapt the gateway software. So I will look for that and come back again. Okay, now I think I need to perform software configuration. If you cancel this and go for the fault codes on uh, the gateway module address 19, you see these fault codes. So right click guided functions and perform software configuration then execute execution of the test Yes, sorry for the blurring on the camera. Please wait, control module data being collected. And for that, for sure, we will need to go online back again with the user and password. Uh, 
Okay, and now I will put the password and come back again. Okay, now after putting the password, uh, the following malfunction has occurred and unexpected system malfunction occurred. Please contact other support, help and support. I think this one is uh, for different part number. So, at least we are having no component protection errors. So, I will go to uh, test the car. And thanks for watching.